Kate's next issue is where to deploy the elephants. But the clue that we were given was that the elephants were stronger against cavalry. I mean, that's just because cavalry on cavalry, yeah. we, we so could be evenly pitched. Elephant on cavalry. Yeah, but if we've got if we've got infantry, we know are impetuous there. If you send elephants at them, they're more. But then, how many elephants do you need to, to send them running? Well, I think Can I just right. check. Where do you yeah. want the? You don't want these elephants in front of the cavalry now, you want them over the other side. I think, I think we concentrate our forces here. Raji forces a decision from his generals. Al gets his way and combines both units of elephants on the right flank to increase their power in an attack. If you all think I'm nuts and that this won't work... No. Can we... Can I, I would just like so. to put the elephant thing in. I'm sorry, I've got this thing about the elephants. On the, can we take a vote on the elephants? Are we going to put all the elephants on the right-hand side or split them so we have some elephants against the cavalry? Let's take a vote on it. I mean, you might as well say, let's call a house meeting. Uh, it's not the way to uh, get a good war-winning strategy into place. She's a general. She wants to abdicate her command authority. She wants to make other people uh, take responsibility for her decisions. Let's just punch the elephants in now, because if, if we don't... Th their effectiveness, I think, is as a... A bank. We also need okay, Raji, are you in on that as well? I'm, I'm, more, I'm more on the line of, of sending the elephants in against their cavalry. That's because that was okay, the beginning. We have a split decision, just, and that's quite important because that's going to be the start of battle. So we need to know what we're going to do with the elephants, either all or well, okay, split. Okay, well, it, well if, we do, if, you, if we do, then what we need to do is compensate the, at the right hand punch yes. mm -hmm. with cavalry. If you're going to take elephants and put them with the cavalry, then we need to take ca cavalry and put them okay. on the right side. With the team divided about how to use the elephants, Al compromises, and the two units are split on both flanks. This action upsets Al's original plan. Will this have repercussions when they send in the elephants? Or will these war elephants be simply too exhausted after running from flank to flank? So by doing that, they're protecting each other's flanks. Would you two like a little bit of extra help? Yeah. yeah. Just to help you plot what's going on. If you come back here, I can give you a real-time satellite view of the whole battlefield. So that's exactly as it is right now, and you can keep an eye on all movements and make sure right now you're getting everything deployed properly. This new feature, a state-of-the-art satellite overview of the battlefield, should be a useful tool for the team's generals, as it helps them stay orientated by tracking the troops' positions at every stage of the battle. You've got worries about this, haven't you? I have. I have got worries, because I just think elephants... This is the big clue that we were given were elephants strong against cavalry. We've got a compromise on that, which is... I'm pleased with I mean, I could be wrong, but... I... The problem with the elephants and cavalry combined as a charge is the cavalry will get there first. And the elephants. Well, I'm saying keep the elephants, hold the elephants, hold them, and let the cavalry come onto us and then set the elephants off because the elephants haven't got that long distance to go, but they will be scary when they go. This continuing disagreement amongst the generals does not bode well for their effectiveness in the heat of battle. While they persist in squabbling, they lose valuable time in this crucial stage of troop deployment. And in terms of your deployment, by the way, do you want to be this far from them? Is no, that... no, no, we need we to need get to a lot we'll close. Well, we need to... Sorry. Fellas, we need to... Guys, we need to, we need to do this deployment much, much closer to them. We need to get in a lot closer, or we're going to be running, running all the way there before we... Uh... Right, well, what we do... We'll, we'll Once we've got the formation, like this, we can move the whole lot forward. forward. Right, OK. I'm being all bossy, but I don't really know what I'm doing. Why you the general? <laughs> We're that, very that, spread out. That long line, is that all... Are those all heavy infantry? They're all pike people. They're all pike. Right, well, I, I think we should haul a couple out and hold them in reserve and concentrate yeah, a bit Yeah, I more. agree. We've and got, box I've got them one up in a reserve bit, Box them up back. a bit more, because we're very spread out and we're weaker like that. You're also 300 miles from them still. Yes. We'll have well, to wrap this by nine. Then we're all going to move We move forward. up a lot closer. Yeah, we just... Up. Get them on the move now. Having no previous instructions from their battling generals, Ricky and Raji have taken deployment into their own hands. And instead of the planned belly formation, they have laid out their troops in a long line. Look at that beautiful formation there, all lined up, no exposed flanks among the phalanxes. Let's see if they can preserve that good, hard front. The enemy's starting to move, by the way. Right. Okay. Oh, my God, really? Having deliberated for so long over troop deployment, the enemy advance catches the team off guard. How will this Egyptian army cope now that battle is imminent? The Seleucids are kicking off the battle. 
in pretty much a historical way. They're moving towards the left side, the left flank of the Egyptian army, and they're going to attack with elephants and cavalry. And probably that hammer blow will initially fall on the Egyptian cavalry. So it'll be interesting to see whether they are driven off the field or whether they're able to stay put and defend themselves. The charging Seleucid elephants on the Egyptian left flank kick off the battle. They head straight for the celebrities' Egyptian cavalry. Are our archers in a position where they can fire on the elephants? Uh, are the archers in a position where they, they will be soon? Get out the way of the elephants, guys. Yes. If you can. Get very much out of the way of the elephants. Oh, my lord, we're started. In the nick of time, the team manoeuvre their cavalry away from the Seleucid elephants. But with the elephants continuing their advance, how will the team counter this threat to their left flank? We need those archers to deal with those elephants right now. The single unit of Cretan archers deploy from the centre to reinforce the Egyptian left flank. What are the archers doing? The right. archers are firing oh, on the elephants. See. Right, let's scare them off Good now. Guys. Let's get them going. Under the cover of arrow fire, a unit of light infantry move in to halt the Seleucid advance. The team's light infantry are coming in on the elephants, and they can potentially cut them to pieces. Yeah. Not, they don't have good. to rely on formation. That's right. They carry spare javelins. They can stick one after the other into those elephants until they bring about a death wound. Now, this is our chance, while they're occupied with that, to send our cavalry right round their right flank. Ricky, can you pull those guys yeah. out? To do this I'll swing. Can, right can we get their cavalry round? And what we want to do is get round behind them. Having evaded the enemy's first strike, the Egyptian cavalry and elephants are sent round to outflank the Seleucid right. Meanwhile, the light infantry struggle to contain the Seleucid elephant attack. Are these here they're being attacked by the elephants we need to pull them out well i've got a load of javelin people going down there now ricky preempts his general and has already sent his spearmen to assist the infantry his sharp reactions pay off as the seleucid elephants are routed meanwhile the Egyptian cavalry continue to make their way towards the Seleucid right flank. Is that where you want to be up here? Yeah, now keep going, keep going forwards and swing around behind them. The enemy cavalry sweep in to block Al's attack. Right, they've, they've come round into ours right, now. Right, engage them then. So they're engaging. Once you've hopefully beaten them, you want to get round behind the enemy line. With a unit of Egyptian elephants supporting, the cavalry battle it out with the enemy's horse to clear a path to the rear of the Seleucid phalanx. Both sides have now lost their coverage on one flank. This is going to be a problem for the team because there's no one protecting their left flank from a whole bunch of elephants. As the cavalry battle rages, a second wave of Seleucid elephants bears down on the exposed Egyptian left flank. What are the archers doing? We've, we're completely losing control of this left flank. Let's get them out of there. The archers, were, we wanted the archers to deal with the elephants, that was the idea. Yeah, You've but they're doing it, the but screen, the, the elephants have come into some yeah, infantry. Can we look at the archers, please? Let's get these infantry out doing? to the side. Yeah, and what these elephants battle. are doing on our let's left flank. Let's get them flank. out of the line of fire. Now. And let's get the archers. Right, I want the archers firing on those elephants. Yeah, they're doing it. Raji is on the case, though Al at the moment seems oblivious to what is happening with his own troops. Are the archers firing on the elephants? <laughs> the tough thing for you is they've got no idea sometimes of what you're talking about in terms of. because they, they don't see the big screen in yeah. the way you do, so. Now you've got a second wave of Seleucid elephants going in here against the Egyptian infantry, but once again they're light infantry, they're hurling javelins into the elephants. And I think pretty soon we're going to see quite a few dead elephants there, like we did with the first attack. Oh, ah, look at that, they're bringing up archers against the elephants. The team has got a clue, look at that. Nothing the elephants can do 
potentially getting shot up. Elephant skin is thick. We'll see how thick it is. 